boys and girls, I am teacher Melinda Hughes and today I will do social studies for grade 5 with you. Our topic for today is the weather. The weather. But we will look at, at a specific topic under the weather and that is the climatic zones. The climatic zones. In this lesson, we will identify the climatic zones that exist in the world. We will also examine some terms that are associated with the climatic zones. So as I go through the lesson and you hear those terms, you will be able to understand what is being said. In addition to that, we will focus a little on map. We will do a little map work, so I want you to prepare your minds, gear up yourself as we go through this lesson on climatic zones. So boys and girls, as we begin, what is a climatic zone? A climatic zone is an area of the earth where all the countries located there enjoy the same or similar climate or climatic conditions. Let us examine some terms that are associated with climatic zones. The first one is lines of latitude. Lines of latitude are lines that run from east to west on the globe. Lines of longitude. Lines of longitude are lines that run from north to south on the globe. Next term is equator. The equator is an imaginary line that divides the earth into the northern and southern hemisphere. And the final term that we will look at today is the prime meridian. The prime meridian. The prime meridian is a line of longitude that divides the earth into the eastern and western hemisphere. So there we have it the terms that you will hear as we go through this lesson. Lines of latitude, lines of longitude, equator, and prime meridian. Let's examine the types of climatic zones. Earth has three main climatic zones. They are the tropical or torrid zone, and that zone is located directly to the center of the Earth. If you notice the line where the equator runs, the torrid zone is located there. The torrid zone or tropical zone is bordered by the Tropic of Cancer, which is found to the north, and the Tropic of Capricorn, which is found to the south. So that shaded area in orange on the globe represents the tropical or torrid zone. Next, we have the temperate zone. The temperate zones. The temperate zones are found in two places. One, to the north of the Tropic of Cancer and to the south of the Tropic of Capricorn. So there we have the temperate zones. Next, we have the polar or frigid zones. The polar or frigid zones are found extremely to the north and extremely to the south of the Earth. So boys and girls, there you have an image showing you where the zones are located. That is the climatic zones. So here again, I'll take you through another set of maps as we examine world climate zones. Yes, we can see that there is a map that shows us where the tropical zone can be identified where the temperate zone is located and also the polar zone. Lines of latitude are lines that run from east to west on the globe. The equator is a line of latitude. Next, I have there the line of longitude, lines of longitude. And of course, lines of longitude run from north to south on the equator, the prime meridian is a line of longitude. Line of longitude, the prime meridian, divides the earth into the east and western hemispheres. Now we will look at the tropical zone. The tropical zone lies between the Tropic of Cancer and the Tropic of Capricorn. 
countries lying in the tropical zone get very strong sunlight and are very hot with very high temperatures. The reason why the countries in the tropical zone are very hot is because they are found very close to the equator where the sun's rays are very short. So that is why we have a tropical zone and countries that lie in that zone are usually hot. They experience hot climate. Countries here experience very hot and wet climate, that is sun and rain. Rain falls heavily in the months of May, June, and December. So those months are referred to as wet months. August and September are known as the hot months. So countries that are found in the tropical zone experience rain and sun or hot and wet climate. What are some of the countries that are found in the tropical zone? So let's look at the map. The map identifies for us or shows us the tropical zone. The tropical zone, if I should refer to it again, can be found between the Tropic of Cancer, which is to the north of the equator, and the Tropic of Capricorn, which is found to the south of the equator. So, what countries lie in the tropical zone? If you look carefully at the map, you will notice that a portion of South America, a portion of the continent of Africa, a portion of the continent of Australia and Central America and the entire Caribbean lie in the tropical zone. So let me identify some of the countries for you. Boys and girls, you can make notes as I go along. Yes, it is important. So let's go. Countries that are found in the tropical zone are, and I am sure you're shouting Guyana, because when we look at the map of South America, where it lies within the tropical zone, Guyana can be located there. So yes, Guyana is a part of the tropical zone. Suriname. Venezuela, Brazil, Aruba, Barbados, Dominica, Cuba, Mexico. Yes, those are some of the countries that can be found in the tropical zone. The next zone that we will examine is the temperate zone. The temperate zone. The temperate zone is divided into two zones. They are the North Temperate Zone and the South Temperate Zone. So let's examine the map. The North Temperate Zone is located to the north of the Tropic of Cancer. And the South Temperate Zone can be located to the south of the Tropic of Capricorn. So that's the region where the Temperate Zone is located. The North Temperate Zone is located in the Northern Hemisphere and more specifically between the Tropic of Cancer and the Arctic Circle, which is to the far north. Some countries that are found in the North Temperate Zone are Italy, France, Germany, the United States of America, Mongolia, Romania, Great Britain, Pakistan, and you can go on. If you have a map of the world, you can go and identify other countries that are located in the North Temperate Zone. Next, we will look at the South Temperate Zone. The South Temperate Zone is found in the Southern Hemisphere between the Tropic of Capricorn and the Antarctica Circle. So, to the south of the Tropic of Capricorn, we can identify or locate the South Temperate Zone. Some countries that are found in the South Temperate Zone are Australia, Argentina, Chile, Botswana, New Zealand, Cape Town. Countries that are found in the temperate zone receive less heat 
than that of the tropical zone. These countries are very cool, and as a result, they experience the four seasons, summer, winter, autumn, and spring. Next, we will look at the frigid or polar zone. The polar zone or the frigid zone receives the least sunlight. The temperature is always cold. The polar zone experiences a lot of snowfall. So boys and girls, countries like Norway, Alaska, Russia, Greenland, Iceland, Finland, we also have Antarctica and the Arctic Circle. So those countries and that particular area are referred to as the frigid or polar zone. So there we have it boys and girls, the three climatic zones that are found on Earth, the tropical or torrid zone, the temperate zone, and the polar and frigid zone. I am sure that after you have learned about these zones, you have in your mind which one you prefer to live in. And so, in our next lesson, we will examine the peoples and the way they live in the different climatic zones. Until then, boys and girls, stay safe and have fun.